people often ask me, why robotic surgery? Well, I think it's just a step in the process of evolution. Just as good gets better and better gets even better, robotic heart surgery is a step in that direction. When it comes to cardiac surgery, we have had open heart surgery, a whole chest bone is cut, it's gone on a step further to get better with minimally invasive surgery. And right now, pioneering the concept of minimal heart surgery is robotic heart surgery. This enables the surgeon to look into the chest by making very small one inch access ports. Now through these access ports, certain instruments go in and they open up like small hands and do all the procedures you want to do, which means we look into a console and do the entire surgery. Now, the robot by itself does not do everything and every movement that the surgeon makes is amplified or reduced to precise movements inside the patient's body. Using the robotic heart surgery, a surgeon has faster movements, more precise movements, can do more delicate surgery, can have superior three-dimensional visualization. Just, you know, the analogy that I like to draw is if you're going to watch a movie, you can watch it in a regular 35 millimeter theater, or you can watch it in 3D on an IMAX. Now that's the difference. That's what robotic surgery is all about. For a patient, robotic surgery has a lot of benefits. The most important is the faster recovery that you have with the robotic heart surgery. So why robotic surgery? Why do we need to progress? Very simple. You have a phone. It used to run on 2G, then became 3, then 4G. And guess what? What kind of G is running right now? 5G. So with every access to the heart is being maintained through a separate part of minimally invasive surgery, access has been made safer, more precise, more accurate with the use of a robot. So I think robots are here to stay. The use, the application, um, and the benefits are only going to grow over time.